So, a flyer, so you stand on one side of the hips of your base. The nearest leg towards the base, step it forward. Once again, the nearest leg to the base, step it forward. Great. The left, so the nearest leg to the flyer in this case, is going to turn in and go for the thigh. So I'm actually trying to find around just above the knee, but not too high on the thigh. I want to place my foot and I want to find the curve of my foot across the thigh here. I can also slightly bend my knee to give a space for the base to place his foot. It's a little bit of an awkward position to start with, but we won't stay here for too long, so it's okay. And I open my arms to the side. My second foot, I want to turn or invert the foot to find the sole of the foot towards the armpit crease here. So I lean in towards that foot. We connect hands into a reverse hand-to-hand -hand grip, both of them. So now I have some weight on this foot, a little bit on this foot, but a, a fair bit of weight in the hands too. And the key here is to lean my fly across to the side so it feels a bit like she's going to fall this way and then I can press up with my left foot. Notice how this one's still bent and receiving, I can press this one up as well. So for the flyer, when that action actually happened, soon as my foot lifted off from the floor, I engage the legs fully. The, light, the tighter you are, the lighter you become. And once we're here, I can guide my flyer's hand towards my leg and help encourage her to hold the leg. I cross my leg and hook them together and here, I hit, bring my hips higher towards the ceiling. Once again, I trust my hips towards the ceiling. This is really important to build stability in the position and strengthen the structure. So one thing as well as a base I can do to help this action is to squeeze my legs together. If I activate and pull my legs together, it helps encourage the flyer to lift. And definitely feel two different things when he did that to me. <laughs> okay. So my top arm just simply rests on my side body or even extend it up towards the ceiling. And to come down, we will connect the hands again and we're going to go back the same way we came. I uncross my feet, coming down to the side. So one thing I would like to give you a clue is instead of we folding like forward as a flyer, think about you want to leaning to the side. Yeah? Perfect. Okay, let's show the spotting. So the spotting for this, same as uh, many other poses that we've done already, we're going to watch around the hips. And lift from the hips, make sure it's nice and secure here. Very good. If the flyer's arm's in the way, it's okay, you can reach over the arm. What I like to do is stay, make sure my hands are around the front of the hips. If my hands are just up and above and below to the sides, if they fall away from me, I might not be able to secure them here. So having the fingers wrapped around the front of the hips, Gives you nice con contact and control. Yeah. Cool. Just be aware as well that if you haven't done this pose before, it can go in many directions. There's different directions of instability for this pose. So if it happens to go this way, just be prepared. You might have to pull back and secure. And you can stand nice and close for this one as well. Okay. Yeah. I can stay hands on until they arrive safely on the floor. Very nice. Yeah. Ninty's up. Who do you want to base this time? Uh, <laughs> Good choice. Let's do. We're going to do yeah. the other side. Open it up. The closest leg to my leg. The closest leg going to, for both of you. So the closest leg for the fly steps forward, the closest leg of the base is the one connecting on the thigh. Mm -hmm. Yes. Very 
Very good. Nice splitting. Okay, so one thing we can see, the foot's a little bit high on the thigh. This is still possible, as you can see, it still works. For a little bit more stability and comfort, sometimes we would suggest the foot be a little bit lower. Next time. Right now it's okay. You can keep it. No problem. And otherwise it looks very stable and very good. Impressive. Alright, <laughs> done. Check the hands. Okay. You can also go down without hands if you feel comfortable in this case. 